Good morning, everyone. Kristen and I are packing up our room and getting ready to leave now. We sit at a hostel here in Sweden, um, so we have a little bit more packing up than usual to do because we have to do things like strip the beds and take the linens out to the hall. We have to vacuum. Um, we have to take the garbage out. Um, so it's kind of weird, <laughs> but that's what you get for a steak for like $80 tonight. Um, anyways, we're kind of happy to leave because we don't really like it here. <laughs> but we're just getting ready. So this is day 86 of our trip across Europe. We are checking out of our place in Sweden and it's snowing as you can see, which is super cool. We haven't been somewhere this cold since the start of the trip. Um, so yeah, we're leaving Sweden. All right, so Kristen and I decided that we're going to walk to the train station. We have three hours. It's like a, f how long have we walked it? 45 minutes? Like 35 minutes. It's like 35 minute walk. We have three hours for our train. It's easy. Um, and Light work. We're saving $6 each by not taking the, uh, the little tram. So, budget travelers. <laughs> I also wanted to, to tell you the uh, story of our hostel we just stayed at. The staff was really nice. The rooms were kind of gross, and as you're checking out, there's like a long list of checkout instructions, including vacuum, strip the beds, and put the linens in like the wash, and uh, wipe the table down, clean all your dishes, that sort of stuff. So I want to stress that one of the activities was vacuum. Um, anyways, so I do a little quick peek see under the bed as Kirsten's about to vacuum. And right in the middle of that is a used pair of women's underwear. Not mine. So I pull it out thinking it is mine and I just left it there. It's not. So I like drop it, we go and we wash our hands. And then we realize that clearly they don't clean the hostel or vacuum it after the people that were like staying there vacuumed it. Like they make the guests do all the cleaning and don't do any other cleaning. Cause if they had just peeked under the bed, they would have known. Anyway, so it's gross and I left them a one star review. It was my first one star. So, yeah. Alright, oh, I'm super wet from the snow. Um, but in Sweden, they have taste like teriyaki chicken um, at Subway. And I love the teriyaki chicken, but I am a fake vegetarian. So, this is fake meat. Anyway, so it looks good. I'm really wet. <laughs> Alright, last stretch for a big walk to the train. We made our trek into the train station. Kristen's doing something on us. <laughs> we made our trek into the train station. We're very happy and now we just get to sit here for like two hours. <laughs> Kristen and I have been sitting here for like an hour and a half. Um, our train is going to be on platform 8. We just, it just like updated. So we're going to walk over there. And I've been carrying around this mask. But there have been no masks in Denmark and Sweden, so... It literally looks exactly like an airplane bathroom, like sink, toilet, like this. it's really small, there's me. Alright, we have made it to Norway, Kristen's favorite place on earth, so we're hoping it lives up to his expectations. Yes, um, it will. We're just gonna walk to the hotel now. It was a long train ride, but we got to talk to Tanya and Byron and see the dogs on the train. Hidden behind here. <laughs> yeah, why is it a secret? Alright, Kristen and I left the train station and came back, we got snacks from the grocery store. Um, so this is like yogurt with fruit on the bottom and then I also got oatmeal with fruit on the bottom. Now he is getting a hot dog and I'm just standing here with this stuff and we don't really know where we're going. <laughs> we just got into our hotel and I think our standards are really low based off the past couple nights because we walked in and this place is amazing. It is amazing. Not That first statement isn't like the hotel is amazing but we were blown away. Look at this room. We've got a tiny little kitchen. There's Carson hanging up his little jacket. And then look at this room. An actual bed. Let's check for used underwear under the bed. We'll see. Oh, no. <laughs> and this little sitting area. Like, this is so cute. And a big TV. We're just going to unpack, maybe have a shower. We'll see. Um, but that might be the end of this vlog. So I will just end it off here in case I don't later on. But today was day 
86, I think I said. Um, so it was just a big travel day, but we're in Carson's favorite country in the entire world, and he's finally been here so he can say it's his favorite. Yeah, and we're in a nice hotel, that's lucky. Yeah. All right, I'll see you guys in the next vlog.